Mornings are for coffee and contemplation, fresh baked. <laughs> Good morning. It's a Sunday morning, and I am back with another uh, state of fresh baked an, uh, address, as it were. Uh, we had, as usual, a fantastic weekend at Disneyland. I wonder if I'll ever come onto one of these shows or ever say, boy, what a crap weekend we had <laughs> at Disneyland. I doubt it. Uh, I used to say we set records every day for most consecutive fun days at Disneyland. But anyway, um, what's in store for Fresh Bake this week? Well, it's it was it was an interesting weekend. It was it was full of celebration, but also full of like let down. <laughs> okay, so what are we celebrating? First and foremost, uh, it's Liz's birthday this weekend. Uh, so help me uh, wishing her a happy birthday. It'll be on Tuesday. Happy birthday to you, Liz. I love you, baby. Uh, it's this is gonna be a fun future for her and I because our anniversary and our, our well actually maybe we you know what we're gonna have to get married <laughs> we're gonna have to to change that anniversary date to somewhere down the line <laughs> don't tell her I said that okay <laughs> anyway Liz's birthday this week uh, on Tuesday uh, the twenty first um, also we're celebrating the Pirates of the Caribbean's birthday fiftieth anniversary of Pirates of the Caribbean and they did a celebration at Disneyland which uh, turned out to be a lot of fun if only you could see it and actually participate in it Uh, because there were points where we did not get to. It was very difficult, very, very crowded. Uh, The lines were enormous for, uh, you know, all of the celebration-related stuff. So we'll get to get a look at that. But we did manage to cover just about everything still, including Jack Sparrow and the bootstrappers and, uh, and and some merchandise. And then we got Beauty and the Beast. We saw Beauty and the Beast uh, on Saturday as well at Downtown Disney. And <clears throat> we, were tr- we were trying to include that in our festivities for Sunday, I mean for Saturday, which meant trying to find Gaston or uh, Belle and, and Beast in the park, uh, trying to have a, you know, a Maurice's treats. Um, but we didn't have enough time for all of that because we spent three hours of our day going to the movies. So uh, most of it is going to be Pirates related. But we did see the movie and we'll, we'll have, at the end of the week, uh, Ian and Liz and I will have some detailed thoughts, <laughs> detailed thoughts on the film. Sarah couldn't make it because she was sick on Sunday. I mean, I keep saying that, on Saturday. She made it for Friday, but she couldn't make it for Saturday. Uh, so wish her well, by the way, while you're at it. Sarah, we missed you on Saturday. Okay, and now for some non-trip report related news. Uh, you know, remember a while back we did the video about the price increase and how we were going to give away a ticket to one lucky uh, fresh bait commenter. And that has happened. Her name is Jacqueline Morales. Uh, so say congratulations to Jacqueline. Jacqueline and a plus one is gonna get to go to Disneyland on Fresh Baked. And I say plus one because uh, Ro- uh, Robert Holtz, uh, longtime contributor to Patreon and supporter of Fresh Baked, uh, you might see his name with a producer credit uh, in the comments, uh, has has opted to, or has, is donating another ticket. Uh, he's, he's, he's He's doubling up on our on our uh, on our donation or whatever you want to call it. So he's gonna he's gonna have because you know it's better when you get to go with somebody that you love, right? When you get to go to Disneyland with somebody that you love and experience it together. So that's cool. So uh, so Jacqueline and her plus one will get to go to Disneyland soon. Uh, your ticket is on the way, Jacqueline. Well, I shouldn't say your ticket. It's a gift card because tickets sending tickets through the mail pff, don't even. It's. <laughs> It doesn't, I don't know, we tried it once, it was a total, total miserable fail. Uh, And now also, here's something that I didn't even notice until I started putting together uh, this week's trip reports, is that I somehow deleted completely the the birthday form on, well not completely, the the, the actual fields where you put in your birthday announcement, the, you know, the dates, the month and the uh, day number or whatever, I deleted it. So... And that means all of the information that was in it uh, for that week. It's only just the week because I delete it every week as I go through it. Uh, so only the last week's information was deleted. But having said that, if you put in a birthday announcement uh, between Saturday the 12th, no, Saturday the, the 11th and Friday the <laughs> 17th, I guess, then you probably had your birthday announcement deleted on accident. So I apologize for that. So announcements this week will be light, but go ahead and put your name back in there if you want. And we'll just do a, you know, anything that I miss uh, on the birthday announcements for the previous week, I always put in on the Monday announcement. You know, you know, if somebody, because a lot of folks think that they can put their date in. If their birthday is 
Sunday the 19th, they could put it in on Sunday and get an announcement or even Saturday or Friday or whatever, but that doesn't how, that's not how it works, right? I, I start editing these videos Saturday night. <clears throat> you know, as soon as I get home, I start editing. That's how I get it done for Monday. So you gotta, you gotta be, you gotta be a week ahead <laughs> at least if you want to get your name in the birthday announcement. So, uh, so if you want, if you want to see your name in a fresh bake video for a birthday announcement, just put it in. If I missed you this week, and if I, if you didn't, I'm sorry. I'm really sorry. Um, it was just a misclick, and I knew one of these days it's gonna happen because every single week I do this. It asks me, do you want to delete just you know these these uh, entries or the whole thing entirely? And this time I I finally did it. I finally clicked the whole thing entirely. <laughs> it's like when you accidentally click send all, you know, <laughs> or reply all. Anyway, I digress. Um, and I think that's it. I just uh, that, that's it for our, our our updates this week. I want to remind everyone to uh, check out uh, mine and uh, Sarah's uh, personal YouTube channels. Uh, she's got Lady Romy, and I've got uh, Duke of Dork. And we're updating, you know, fairly often uh, on, on our own home adventures. And then we've also got the Ninja who's just started gaming again uh, over at Fresh Bait Gaming. If that's their thing, go check it out. So far, no commentary, but he's, <laughs> I'm trying to talk him into it. You know, it's, he's just, he's bashful, you guys. He's bashful. He's really bashful. So um, he doesn't think that anybody wants to hear what he has to say. And I'm like, that's just not true. That is just not true. Uh, maybe not everyone, but there's enough people that want to hear what you want to say that makes it fun. Uh, so, you know, go support. You know what? Leave him a comment. Hey, say, Ninja, I want to hear what you got to say. And hopefully that'll encourage him. All right, guys. Uh, stay tuned for the uh, 90 seconds coming up later today. And stay tuned for the um, Knothole Gang also coming up later today. By the way, I should mention the Knothole Gang. Um, giant at-ats in the building. So there's that. <laughs> we'll show you that. <laughs> All right, guys. Uh, see you next week. Bye. Fresh baked and stuff.